Hey there, how's it going? Aaron Rennick here, Middell Public Schools. Today we're going to work on setting up an email address specifically using Gmail. Um, the reason for this is our enrollment process moving forward will be entirely online and that process requires an email address. It can be a current one that you have. Uh, this video is for any of our patrons that do not have an email address currently set up. So here we go. First thing you have to do is open up an internet browser. It can be Internet Explorer, Google Chrome, Firefox, anything that you like to use. Um, and then up in the address bar, you're going to type in www.gmail.com. Once you have that typed out, you can hit enter. And it should bring you to this page that you see here. Uh, and this is will basically follow the prompts to create an account. Once you're on this page, you'll click this blue button that's create an account. And that's going to bring you to the process of uh, putting in your personal information. Uh, it starts off with your name. I'm just going to use example for today. Um, and then typically what this does is for your username, it'll set up a recommendation if you like, but you can change this, this username. Uh, this is ultimately what's going to create the email address for you. Uh, it can be example one, two, three. Um, and if it's not available, it'll let you know. So that username is already taken. So you just have to try a number, work this around. Um, Again, this can be whatever you would like that email address to be. Once you have an available one, it'll let you know. There'll be no red on the screen. It'll have you set up a password. It does like it to be a strong password, letters and numbers of some sort of combination. Again, that's completely up to you. Once that's good to go, you can hit next. And that's going to bring you to the, the next bit of your personal information. Uh, you would insert your phone number, a recovery email address that says it's optional. It does ask, you have to have your birthday um, and your gender put in. And then once that's ready to go, I'm going to go to another screen for this next explanation. Uh, you'll hit next, as you see here on the screen. So again, phone number, date of birth, gender, you'll hit next. And that's going to bring you to reviewing Google's terms of service and privacy policy, privacy policy. Scroll through those terms and then hit agree. And then your account is created and you're ready to go. Um, and then you just you'll go to gmail.com to sign in in the future. All right. Thanks so much. If you have any questions, uh, please reach out to our district and we'll help you answer what we can. Thanks.